Hey everybody, so today I'm going to be doing a Jujube unboxing and haul for you guys. This was a present from Mark, just kind of like a good job present, I don't know, <laughs> just kind of to do with my YouTube channel and how well I've been doing, so thank you babe. But I do have my box from Amazon right here. All this stuff is pretty much pertaining to the fact that I'm going to have two under two here in a couple months and I wanted a new diaper bag. I've wanted this diaper bag for like a year now even before we were trying to get pregnant with Remy. So this is a long time coming and I'm just super excited. So I'm gonna get started. The first thing I see is my Passy Pod that I got. And I just got it in the Monarch print. I wanted something black to kind of go with whatever diaper bag I may want or whatever print I have. And if you're unfamiliar with Jujubee, that's what the inside of it looks like. So the next things that I got were quicks. I have a few different ideas of how I'm gonna use these in my diaper bag, and I'll be sure to post videos when I finally get that mastered. But the first one I got was in the Commodore print. I love it. It's so, so pretty. This print was actually the first one that got me started into liking Jujube. I don't even know where I saw it from, but I love navy and gold. That was the colors for our wedding, and I'm absolutely obsessed with them. And it was hard not to get the diaper bag in this print, but I wanted something a little bit more permanent. You're gonna hear Sophie just running amok over there because she's having the time of her life with her toys. But anyways, so the Be Quick does come with a strap on the inside, but that's what the inside looks like. Oh, it's so pretty. I'm so excited to use this stuff. And then the next one I got was in the Admiral print. This was a, another print that I really liked, but I felt like I couldn't get a lot of. Just is blue, navy blue, with some gold anchors. I don't know, I felt like since I'm not a mom of boys, it didn't fit me too well. But I absolutely love this. That's the same lining inside. But yeah, so I'm super excited about these quicks. I have a few different ideas for them. Another thing, I guess I'm excited about everything, but... I'm excited about this fuel cell that I got. I got it in the Countess print, which I love. I was going back and forth between Empress and Countess, and I'm glad I got the Countess. But this is what the inside of the fuel cell looks like. Now, this is kind of like an insulated bottle snack bag that's kind of its main purpose, at least that's what I've gathered from it. But I know people who use these for a ton of different things. I have a few different ideas for this thing as well, especially when it comes to like pumping and all kinds of different things. So I'm sure you guys are gonna be seeing a bunch of this. So the last thing in here is my diaper bag that I've wanted and I was kind of scared about it because a lot of people told me that this was a big bag and I'm a big bag kind of girl. I like big bags, especially with diaper bags. I'm an overpacker and I feel like with having two under two. So, 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 so. So with having two in diapers, I kind of felt like I needed a lot of extra space and looking at this diaper bag, it's big, but it's not too big for me. But this is the diaper bag that I got. It is the Be Prepared diaper bag. It does look huge next to me, like looking in my viewfinder. This thing does look huge, but it is honestly so pretty. Now I got it in the Queen of the Nile print, which I've heard like 50-50 things on. For some people, looking at it makes them sick. <laughs> and like some people just don't like it. It kind of looks great from far away, but I love this print. I've loved it since I watched like one of my very first Jujube videos was about this bag and I fell in love with it. And I've just wanted it ever since. I also love that all the legacy stuff has gold hardware. I've said it before, I'll say it again. I love yellow gold. Mark did point out that all the stuff had stickers on it so you couldn't really see the true finish of the nameplates, but they are so nice too. But this is my diaper bag. I'm going to kind of squish it out so you guys can get a better idea of what this looks like. Mark has wrangled Sophie behind the camera, so if you hear even more loud noises, it's coming from her. She's right over there. But I did put some stuff in the bag to kind of inflate it and show you guys what it actually looks like. But it does have two tote handle straps that I'm trying to dig out right now. And it does also have a messenger strap. It's over here. But this is what the bag looks like 
all puffed up. But yeah, I'm super, super excited about this. One of this bag forever, like I've said. And I can't wait to bring you guys some videos on like packing and different stuff like that. I really can't wait to see what this diaper bag can do because it's been known for its organization and just being amazing. So I'm really excited about this stuff. Thanks again to Mark who was kind enough to get this stuff for me, babe. Let me know what kind of videos you'd like to see me make with these bags. If you have any ideas or anything like that, just leave them down below. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's my cue to leave. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and as always, thanks for watching.